specific points. Right now we have a reporter in VGC, one of the places that election was cancelled and postponed uh, uh, till today. He's standing by to give us a report. Emmanuel uh, Olubaboku, good morning. Emmanuel, please unmute yourself so that you can talk to us. Morning. Hello, good morning. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you now. Okay, good yeah, morning. Good morning. Uh, you are at VGC right now. What is what is the situation yes. report? Uh, so far, as you can see right behind me, uh, everywhere around me, the, old, the residents are right, like they're all out, saying that uh, they are going to definitely uh, cast their vote today. The electoral officers are all you know, moving around, checking. You know, even the voting has even commenced, as, as we speak. Voting has commenced, and it's peaceful now, as it is. Uh, electoral officers are still, uh, you know, going around making sure that uh, the other staffs are actually doing the right thing, actually, in terms of the uh, Beavers machine and any other coordination that is left to be done. And voting has commenced in some places. Why some are still trying to coordinate themselves, like the one that's just behind me here. Some are still trying to coordinate themselves. But so far, uh, the uh, electoral process is peaceful. I can say the but was in few seconds. Seconds and you see some police uh, official, you see police personnel, I mean, police personnel. You see that they're all in their numbers now, different foods stationed all around uh, the VGC, uh, stationed around the polling units here. Everything is peaceful as it is. Spoke to some of the uh, residents and they said they owe for a better, you know, for it to remain this way to the end of uh, the voting today. But so far, there have not been any issue. Everything is going smoothly. The Beavers Mission is working fine. Everyone is well seated and coordinated. And the vote is going. Okay. W w the major reason this election was postponed to today is uh, uh, security yes. situation in VGC. So I'm just wondering uh, yeah. the number of policemen that are there and if you think these policemen are sufficient to man this place so that there will be no violence and like the core members complained the last time that they were, they were detained or they were abducted or something like that that they complained yes. about. Do you think the security uh, presence is good enough for the number of people that are there? Well, with the number I've seen, uh, the number of security personnel I've seen, I think it's good enough, even though I've spoken to some or to some of them, they said they are still deploying more down to this area. While I was coming into BGC, uh, uh, coming to BGC, I saw deployments of even military personnel just right outside the gate, some man in the gate, some man around uh, BGC to make sure that nothing uh, like uh, maybe anything like riot or foggy happens right there. BGC. So, with the security personnel I'm saying here, yeah, definitely, definitely, I would say that uh, they will be able to manage the uh, station here in VGC and there will be anything of such someone like um, a Corgi or whatsoever it is. At what point or uh, what time did the electoral materials arrive at the VGC polling center? I the voting materials they are the all around, even though they commenced late around past nine why according to what when i asked some of the officials they said they are trying to make sure that the Davis machine is working fine and everything's in place everything fine because they have to get some uh, information from the processes to be able to know that okay maybe they can go ahead with the voting check out the papers the uh, all the papers and the rest you know if everything is still intact from looking at what happened yesterday when they were in the when they were dismounted from uh, actually voting where they all took them outside the gate. So that was what delayed the process. But looking at the timing they got there, according to them, they've been here since to eight, for minutes to eight, waiting patiently to make sure that everything is in place before they commence voting. Okay. Thank you very much, Emmanuel. We are hoping that we'll have more information as time goes on. Just stay safe wherever you are until then. Thank you so much.